Is Panama safe? Look, we all know what happened yesterday in the US. Is it anywhere truly safe these days? America, France, Europe in general, they all have their own issues. But let's talk facts. The sheer amount of Americans moving to Panama says a lot. Yesterday's assassination attempt on Trump? Well, safety is relative. Of course, Panama has their own sketchy areas. But this is something you usually avoid. You will be just fine. Meanwhile, the sight of BMWs, Porsche, Teslas and Panama is even more common than in most places in Europe. You can walk around with a fancy clock, with your nice designer clothes without a second sword. So yes, Panama is pretty safe. So here's the deal. I actually lived myself already four and a half years in Panama, now going for my five years here and I'm feeling amazing and never had any issues. I started my own business as a German language coach, worked even for German language institute in the beginnings. In the last years, we even partnered up with local experts here to really showcase the best of Panama. In that time, I've built a thriving community of almost 100,000 people alongside of Mike in Carolina, who as well are living, investing and traveling here in this beautiful country. Let's just say I know Panama inside and out. I can guarantee you get the full package when it comes to relocation and real estate. Panama's stability is entered by its canal, the second biggest free zone after Hong Kong in Cologne, its modern banking system, low taxes that have attracted people from all over the world over a hundred years already ago since the first canal was built. The shops in the free zone are actually managed by Muslims from Dubai, who maintain actually a closed gate community close to Cologne. The shops in the free zone are managed by Muslims from Dubai who actually maintain their place close to the canal in a gate community with tremendous villas. Here you'll see Muslims, Jews, Catholic people all living peaceful together because Panama is a county where people focus on making business and getting things done for real. And if you don't follow the rules, there are laws that kick you out of the country faster than you can think of. But if you play by the rules, you are doing more than okay. You're doing great actually. Because if you disrespect the culture or if you speak against the government, you can get into problems. That is very important to know. But why should you? You're a visitor that is allowed to stay in the country. So why should you do things like that? If you maintain that margin, you always will be doing just fine. If you're looking for a relocation tour or you're looking to invest in one of the most stable economies in Panama, write me the word invest in the comments and I personally will reach out to you.